Well, first, we have a great respect for Green Bay, and, and our guys knew what we were coming to face. Uh, the oldest team in the league, a, a team that had walked in here a year ago and won it, and, and knew they could. And, and so we knew what we were up against. Uh, I thought we had a great week of preparation. It was a long week. They were excited to finally get a play. Even after, you know, you sit here and you watch two days of the tournament and you haven't played yet. And, and so I, I, I give the kids all the credit because for a young team, they, they, they stayed with it. And you know what? It made a big difference for us finally having all our guys, uh, having Godwin back, allowed me to rotate the guards more and keep guys fresher. And, and, and again, players, Players make plays this time of year, and we had some guys really make some plays, and if we hadn't got a little silly there at the end, it, it would have never got close. But, um, you know, I, again, I have great respect for Link and, and Green Bay and his kids, and and uh, and I think they have a respect for us. We had great games with them both times, and I, I think what this tournament has showed is uh, the league had a lot of balance in it. and. and it, you know, I, I think that that's just showing in the tournament right now. Go ahead and open up for questions. Again, please state your name and your affiliation and if there are questions for the student athletes, we'll let them go. Uh, Joey Yashinsky with the Horizon League. Uh, Dominique, uh, you guys are up 17. It gets trimmed all the way to two. And you're going to the line with about a minute left. I mean, it, it, is your heart beating a little bit faster or are you just uh, kind of a cool customer? Uh, I mean, I was fine. You know, I shoot. Free throws with uh, one of our assistant coaches, Coach Seth, every day. He's always working on us with our free throws. So I was pretty confident going shooting free throws. Paul Arden, the Northwest Indiana Times. This is for any one of the three of you. You're, you've been here for two days. You've seen the games. The upsets from yesterday, is that in your mind? Like, look, if they can do it, we can do it too? Well, I got worried that all the luck had got used up <laughs> as a coach. You, you go, oh man, did, did everybody pull it off that could? And, and yet, with the format of the tournament, you know, usually three through six is pretty even. I know some people don't think we're quite up in there, but, but those are pretty even teams. And even though Green Bay had swept us, and even Northern Kentucky Wright State second game tonight, even though Northern swept them, they were both great games. So, I, you know, I, I think our guys knew just because of the previous games with Green Bay that, that if we came and played well, we were going to have an opportunity. And the thing with Green Bay is you just got to keep scoring because they're just going to keep playing, so you got to keep scoring. But I, 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 I just got worried that everybody used all the luck and we wouldn't have any left. We'll break down the line if you want to answer it. Mike Pankow, UICFlamesBasketball.com. Uh, Dom, um, you came out, hit your first three-pointer of the second half, and then you assisted on uh, Tark's three-pointer right after that. How big was it for you guys to get off to a big start to start the second half? Uh, really good. You know, I was in foul trouble a little bit in the beginning. But, you know, I had to get myself back on. Ferry did a great job finding me, so I had to find him back. And that's how we did that. Uh, Ty, uh, Cantor had a pretty big first half for them. Didn't have quite the same effect in the second half. Uh, did you kind of take it upon yourself, defensive player of the year, to make it a little bit tougher on him? I mean, yeah, uh, in the first half, I guess I kind of got tired a little bit, so he got his position on me. But in the second half, we just we didn't want to lose, so we had to get the stuff we needed to do, and we did. Are there any other questions you have student asking? Ty, you guys got Milwaukee again tomorrow night. Um, you handled them pretty well at home the first time, but that, that second game, that amazing overtime game, uh, what, what's it going to take to knock those guys off? You just got to um, take the same approach you take with every game. Um, you can't lose game any confident. You can create really well, so you're just going to go back, prepare again, and come back with the confidence we need to the win. Dominique, you guys uh, get a lot of freshmen, a lot of youth on the team. Mm -hmm. Doesn't seem like it matters to you guys. You think maybe the magnitude of the moment will get to you playing in a big arena it's the first time, but you guys seem to uh, have it under control. Uh, yeah, you know, we've been in big games all year long, so, you know, we were kind of, you know,
know, confidence, you know, we got older guys, me and Ty, just talking <laughs> to the guys on the court also, just keeping everybody together, just staying, keeping our composure, so, you know, we kept it together at the end, because we were, you know, used to that type of stuff. Do you see now that you can go back to the locker room, thank you? And then we'll continue with questions for the